Hello, this is Mike, nostressmike.com. And uh, I'm in Mississippi now, and you see the rain's been getting a little bit. It's, it's funny, it's been overcast uh, for two days now since I was in Florida and working my way back, back to Oklahoma. But uh, uh, now there's some rain and getting more and more. It hasn't been much rain, it's been sprinkling more than anything. I think now it's about the same thing, but a little bit more now. But anyway, what I want to share with you is um, my, uh, what's going on with my, chasing women. But now I'm, I'm chasing wild women, man. So. And uh, uh, I'll give you an update on some of the kind of stuff that I've been learning. And uh, I say, I haven't chased women since I got a teenager, before I went to Vietnam. And, uh, and I say, uh, after Vietnam, I just kind of did a withdrawal, and then, uh, like I say, we did an arranged marriage. So I never really had the date. So, it's, so now this, and now it is 40. Now it's been 42, 42 years later, and uh, so this is a little, little different for me. But it's kind of funny because uh, it's completely different now. When you're young, you got dreams, you got. You know, you don't, no telling what, you know, the, the future is open to anything. And um, now, I say 64, um, I've got a track record. Uh, I know what I can do. And uh, I know my limitations, which is very few limitations. And uh, I can go places, I can do things that I wasn't able to do when I was young. So now I've been looking at women different, and I've noticed. Now I still haven't been. I've been out with maybe maybe six or eight different women here. Um, let's see, in the last, uh, I guess I started looking for women here maybe five months ago. Five, maybe, maybe yeah, about five months. About five months ago. I've been looking. I've been out with maybe half a dozen or so. And um, uh, one thing I've noticed now, as I'm older and wiser, uh, there's not much time waste. I don't waste a whole lot of time. Uh, I'm not into the dating thing. So when I go out with them, I'm just going out with them like I'd go out with anybody else. And uh, you know, I don't, don't do any sweet talking or, or none of that kind of stuff. We just kind of talk and talk about ourselves and then uh, about our likes and dislikes and what we do and you know and what we've done in the past and uh, it's kind of funny because it seems like in the first date I can pretty much see both of us we can, we can both see if we want to go on with the next date I really found that kind of odd. Uh, I say, uh, uh, you know, just you're, you're either going to be thinking maybe, and then we're ready for the next day, or you can pretty much figure out well it's, it's going the wrong direction, and it's just it's just a nice simple. It was nice to meet him, and I'll tell you, I've been meeting some really nice nice ladies, and. Uh, we don't have to play the games and stuff we did, when, you know, when you're young. I say all the sweet talk and, and all that kind of stuff. So it's it's been really unique, and uh, I really I'm still trying to figure out. I thought I knew what I wanted, and I really do. I know what I want, but what I want and what's going to happen isn't going to be the same thing. I can see that right now, and uh, I was open for a new whatever and uh, uh, I know my life's going to be different so I, let's go, let's give me something different so I've been open. It's funny because uh, uh, I really believe the woman is smarter than the man so uh, if uh, the woman thinks that I'm something and something she can work with 
and it's the same thing when we were younger, you know, the woman, what kind of, they'll look at a man, what can they do with this guy, you know. Well, like I say, now i got a track record. So now, uh, they're figuring out, do they want to get on with the ride? Uh, and so, it, it's kind of funny, because I'm ready to get off the ride. <laughs> I'm ready to start something new. Uh, uh, like I say, in the, personal safety, I've had people ask me, well, what, where's a good place to go? Uh, because everybody knows the economy's crashing and everything's going bad. So, um, and the morals, there's no morals, everything's bad. So everybody wants to know where to go. And I've been telling everybody now, since I've been back, uh, you need to be with people you trust and the people you love. And that's that, the best place you can be. Rich people, they've already gone wherever it is that they're going to go and they think they're going to be rich or they're going to be safe. So, but I say, you just got to be with the right people is all it is. And that's why I'm out here beating the bush trying to find uh, somebody that I can trust and, and in the way of a woman. I get along with a lot of people, I meet a lot of people, so it's a little different. No, I don't, and when I say I know what I want, but I'm not going to get it, is um, I've been finding out these gals aren't near as adventurous as they think they are. And, because uh, I say when they come across me, they find out well, what adventure really is. And uh, for a lot of them, it, it's a little bit too much for them. And uh, the ones that I've come across that uh, they're ready to go for the adventure, uh, they're not healthy enough for the adventure uh, because they don't really know what they're getting into. And, uh, but it's just the intrigue of uh, uh, being with me and going places and doing things. But they still, they don't have a, they have a, having a hard time understanding how health is that important. So trying to find somebody that's healthy and adventurous uh, has, has been an adventure. And um, I say it's not we need to join my life. I can join theirs, or we can do both. Uh, you know, I say mine. You know, hey, we can just take off. You know, whenever we want, we can go anywhere we want to go and stay as long as we want to. Uh, but like I say. A lot of these women, especially, uh, they just, they don't, uh, they're having a hard time leaving their comfort zone, even for a month or two. And uh, so it's, it's a little different. It's a little different. Uh, so like I say, I'm, um, I'm chasing the women still. Uh, this is, uh, I think, the 17th of November. I'll be leaving in about a month if I don't find anyone. I'll be leaving uh, probably about the middle of December, heading back to Guatemala. Uh, I want to spend a week or two in Mexico, and uh, uh, I say I got a couple more down there that they want to they want to meet me. So, um, and I say it's. They speak English. Now, now, not like my wife. My wife, you know, uh, she didn't speak English at all when we got married. So it, it took us a little while to get to know each other. Now I'm kind of looking for somebody to speak English, so a little bit of English anyway. So uh, I'll be uh, stopping there. If I can't find anybody here in the States, I'll be stopping there. And uh, uh, I say I'm on my way back to Guatemala, and then I say there's the words out in Mexico and Guatemala now but, that I'm looking so now they're starting to show up but uh, I'll tell you healthy is hard to find in any country now I will admit they're a little more adventurous uh, in third world countries and, uh, and like I say I don't, know. I don't know I'm just still looking we'll see what happens I tell you, you guys that are looking for gals, I feel sorry for you, man. This isn't fun at all. And uh, like I say, I'm not looking for a date. I'm, I'm uh, you know, I'm looking for marriage. So, but now I'm even gonna have to reconsider that. I may not be uh, 
marriage may not be the way to go. Uh, and I say that's against my morals and values. So I don't know. I mean, this is some of the most confusing times I've been going through in the last couple, two or three months. I've seen way too much. I've done way too much. I don't have a woman to uh, keep me calm and kind of explain to me what it is I'm seeing. So, uh, like I say, I've been doing and seeing stuff that I really don't know what's going on. And uh, so like I say, I'm kind of open to a lot of stuff. And now, well, boy, I hate thinking my age. I'm, you know, well, I'm kind of hoping I could just go on. There's, there's so much more I still want to do, and place I want to go, and people I want to meet. You know, so, but I say I don't know. Uh, I'm not. I'm starting to think maybe I don't. I need to settle with a, a country gal, or maybe I need to settle with a city gal. I just don't know. We just just thinking. I don't know where we're gonna go with this, but still looking, and I'm doing good. I'm healthy, and everything's going right. So I'll catch y'all later. This is Mike, no stress Mike.com.